Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. So this is Pramod and this is another Comsha A plus score one practice test simulations or you can call performance based questions. So this simulation is the type of parts of the motherboard. So let's go to the simulation. So this is the simulation. So this is the drag and drop type of simulations. So drag and drop of each component onto the label areas to the label parts of the motherboard. So as you can see here on the picture, these are the label areas A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N and O. So in actual exam, you have to select correct component of each label area and drag and drop off to the each label area. So let's check the default components for the simulations. So the default components for the simulations are the first one is a memory model connectors 1, 2, 3, 4, processor power connector, CPU socket, fan connector, CPU fan, floppy drive connector, floppy, CMOS battery, front panel input output connector, main power connector, ID drive connector, SATA connector, USB connector, PCI Express X1 card connector, PCI Express X16 card connector, PCI Express X4 card connector, PCI card connectors. So you have to select correct component each label area in these sections. So let's check the correct answer for this simulation. So correct answer for the simulations are so first label area you have to select memory model connector 1, 2, 3, 4. In B label area you have to select main power connector. In C label area, you have to select floppy drive connector, floppy. In D, PCI Express X16 connector. In E, you have to select ID drive connector. In F, you have to select front panel input output connector. In G label area, you have to select SATA connector. In EH label area, you have to select CMOS battery. In I label area, you have to select PCI card connector. In J label area, you have to select PCI Express x4 connector in k label area you have to select pci express x1 card connector in l label area you have to select fan connector cpu fan in m label area you have to select cpu socket in n label area you have to select usb connector in last o label area you have to select process power connector so let's check the answer for the in the motherboard area so these are the correct answers in the motherboard sections so you have to check, you have to select correct component in the each section. So in A area, this is the model, memory model connectors 1, 2, 3, 4. In B area, you have to select main power connector. In C level area, you have to select floppy drive connector. In D level area, you have to select PCI Express X16 card connector. In E level area, you have to select ID drive connector. In F label area, you have to select front panel input output connector. In H area, you have to select SATA connector. In the next label area, you have to select CMOS battery. In next label area, you have to select PCI card connector. In next area, you have to select PCI Express X4 card connector. Next label area, you have to select PCI Express X1 card connector. In the next area, you have to select fan connector, CPU fan, as you can see on the picture. The next is the CPU socket. This is the CPU socket. And this is the USB connector. And the last label area is a processor power connector. So let's check the next slide. In this slide, you have to, if you want more explanation, so please refer these links. And this is the default diagram of the motherboards. So I hope you are clear this video. So you have completed this model. So study hard, good luck and thanks for watching. If you like this video, please don't forget to subscribe to this channel to see more videos like this. I will upload next part shortly. Thanks for watching. Thank you.